All right, speaking of each summer, there are dozens of new foods to tempt your taste buds at the Minnesota State Fair. We made a new blue ribbon worthy sandwich at the Minnesota Farmers Union coffee shop. Good afternoon, step right up, Minnesota Farmers Union. Amelia and Chris are in the back cooking all your favorites. New fried green tomato sandwich. Amelia's favorite, the pork schnitzel. Pounded pork cutlet, then they schnitzel it. So our first step for making the fried green tomato sandwich is a beautifully toasted bun. Okay. So it holds up to all that stuff that we're going to put on the bun. Okay. So we start with some uh, melted butter. Uh -huh. We leave the butter solids in there. So there's a little bit of splatter from it, but it gets really nice and toasty. And you throw it on there? Yeah, you Back throw it right on there. <laughs> I always try to make sure to give them a little spin so the butter gets evenly distributed. I thought you were the cook at the house. I am the cook at the house. <laughs> don't tell anyone. No, no. You put those in. You put these in. We're, I, don't like, we're, I don't like to crowd them too much. There's a really big one there. That's Chris, I, I just want to say, Chris, yes. we're around a lot of heat. A lot, a of, lot of heat. Yeah, we got to stay hydrated okay. all day long. And how long do you yep. put those in? So we do them for about three to four minutes. They'll come up and float to the top when they're ready to go. That's oh, there you go. That's better. They get it on the bacon shop. Oh my gosh. You're yeah, on your own. I'm on. I know. I always give it a little shake to start. And you put it on the bottom? Bottom and the top. Oh, look, look at that. doesn't like mayonnaise. And if you, you can obviously get You're very generous. Here. Yeah, you're very generous. generous. I'll let you finish that part oh up. Oh of our thick cut bacon from our friends from Pastures of Plenty and Hidden Street. Take it in there, get a piece of bacon. Oh yeah, man. That really bumps them up. All right. And now, we go with the tomatoes. If it's a big one, you put it on. The romaine crunch, you put that down, you hold it for a second, and boom. Oh, you know what? I think we got it. And here you go. Go on. Go get him. Go get him. All right, let's go. Come this way. Here, sir. Oh, you got a line. You got to go faster. We better start frying more. Hey, less eating, more work. Chop, chop. We got a line. I told you to go with rock and not scissors. How does he always win? Oh. All right, what are these? Oh, nice. There we go. Sorry, we're so slow. We'll pick it up. Number four. Number four. Number four for Channel Four. This is really cool. I'm gonna tell you how to do your technique. Yeah. But did you see how I just kind of guided it as opposed to jerking it? That's a big yeah. key, right? You, you you don't you could finesse it. You don't need to just, you know, some of you kids get in such a hurry to serve us. I'll keep that in mind. Thank okay. you. Thanks I'm here to help. You here to help. What did you get today? Maple cream nitro cold brew. That's a lot. Yeah. Viking fans don't get maple green nitro caramel maca waka. You know that, right? We get losses in the playoffs. We get losses in the playoffs? <laughs> hey, one heard a little tip. These kids work hard. That's true. Boy, I can't. That, I, I would have thought he was a Packer fan the way he was the way he was putting those dollar bills back in. <laughs> Maxie giving customers. You great. guys need to go front of the house, not back of the house. I don't know how you always end up at the front of the house, and Chris and I are in the heat. Uh, train for bully, man. train yeah. for management. <laughs> well, they do. They're delicious though, and there's BLT or vegetarian that costs fifteen dollars, and you yeah. get them there. Yeah. Still, still like the pork schnitzel. The pork schnitzel That's is great. No doubt. Yeah. Fun. Yeah.